Good morning, y'all. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. Yep, it is leg day today. And it's been, I wouldn't say it's a rough week, but having a fitness assessment on Monday, yesterday's workout was pretty intense as well. So hopefully today doesn't disappoint y'all at all. So what we have going on today is we have four rounds of what's on the board. So four boards through 15 reps each, unless otherwise noted. And you got 35 minutes to do it. So we'll start off with the weighted sit-ups, barbell back squats, medium on those, bicycle crunch, double kettlebell front rack squats, wall balls, weighted wall sits, in and outs, and dumbbell front rack forward lunge. So Weighted sit-ups over here on this side of the world, right? So pick a weight that's going to work for you, work through it. You should be able to get all 15 reps in and have maybe a couple, three left at the end, a um, little bit of gas in the tank. That's kind of what it's, it's designed to do. Same thing here with the back squats. You want to pick a weight that's going to be medium-ish for you where you can get through a good 10 reps unbroken, after like the 10th, I mean, you, you could probably get through 15 unbroken, um, but then you might be going a little bit on the light side, right? So we want to get this leg day really working those muscles to their capacity to do, right? And get the, the load on there. So going a medium weight, I would say probably 50 to 60% of your one rep max. If you know that, then you're, you're golden, right? So that would be more of like a medium type weight. To use okay um, so again if your max back squats 300 pounds I would go in here from about 160 to 165 um, on there and I think that'd be a good um, weight to run with on that um, bicycle crunch per side on those guys double kettlebell front rack squat so we're gonna have both kettlebells up in the front rack it's gonna tax your core quite a bit get nice and deep in those squats um, this is going to work on depth a lot too, okay, and really start working on that core, work on those lats. It's going to build a lot of stuff up that you need for stability for pretty much any lift that we do in here. Wall balls, definitely some leg stuff going on there, right? Get some timing issues, a lot of things going on with the wall ball. Weighted wall sits, that'll happen probably over here on this side. We can do it over here too if you want to, all right, but we're going to have a weighted wall sit, so... Dumbbell is the plan. Have it overhead if you want. I think that worked out good. 45 seconds on that. In and outs over here on the mats. Again, some core work. And then some dumbbell front rack forward lunges. We're going to have the dumbbells in the front rack, meaning we're going to have our arms up, elbows up, and one of the heads of the dumbbell would be touching your shoulder. Keep it there in the front rack. And we're going to do some nice forward lunges on that, working on keeping our posture as well. So that's the plan for today. So it's going to be a lot of legs, a lot of stuff going on. So make sure you get in a little bit early, get some stretching in, get some rolling out in, get a little extra prep work done so you can beast mode on the workout and go for it, right? So that's it for today. That's it for leg day. Um, What's going on? Pretty much it, I guess, for right now. I'm trying to think of anything else that we have coming up. Um, of course, Friday evening at 6.30 p.m. is Ultimate Hit. If you want to get some extra work in um, before the weekend, it's a great time to do it. Uh, Saturday, Coach Kim is leading us through on the workout for the free 9 a.m. community workout. Uh, yeah, and, and that should do it. And, of course, a boat party coming up. There's an invite out on Facebook right now for it. So sign up early. Save a little bit of money. So I'll let you all go with that. You have a great rest of your day. Make it a great day. And I will see you this afternoon or this evening. Bye, y'all.